Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. Hope you all are doing great. And today in this video, we are going to see what is discharge card and why it is mandatory. Can't we claim the medical expenses without discharge card? And where we can get this discharge card? What are the things should be mentioned in the discharge card? So, I am going to answer all these questions in this video. Don't skip the video, watch till the end. But before moving into the video, if you are new to this channel and haven't subscribed to our channel yet, then do subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so that you will get the notification whenever we upload a new video. So coming back to our topic, if you check your TCS mail, most of the employees have got this mail regarding this discharge card, which is an internal broadcast mail from uh, HIS help. Uh, and I'm not supposed to show that mail in this video due to security reasons, but uh, you can check it in your TCS mail. And I'll also discuss all the things which are there in that mail. So, uh, first of all, let's see what is a discharge card. Discharge card or we can also call it as discharge summary. Uh, it is a document which contains the summary of all the details of the patient like uh, date and time of the admission into the hospital and uh, date and time uh, of discharge from the hospital, the condition of the patient health at the time of admission, the treatment that uh, patient undergone during the period of course, and the results received after treatment at the hospital like this, uh, uh, some more details of the patient and treatment uh, and the overall summary of the patient and treatment details will be there in that discharge card. So that is called discharge card or uh, discharge summary. If you want to see the sample of the discharge card uh, in the mail which the HIS help has sent to the employees, they have mentioned a QR code there in that mail. You can uh, scan that QR code with your mobile, ca mobile camera. Then you will get a link. Then you can download the sample of the discharge card from that link. I will also try to give you the link of that sample directly in the description. You can go and check. You will get the sample from that link. You can check the sample. Prepare the uh, discharge card based on that sample. So now uh, let's see why the discharge card is mandatory. Discharge card is mandatory thing to claim the medical expenses in HIS portal. Previously, we used to claim medical expenses using the bills you got from the hospital, right? But now you can't claim the medical expenses without discharge card. Discharge card needs to be submitted for every hospitalization claim. Even it is a, a daycare procedure or hospitalization for more than 24 hours. Even it is for one day also you need this discharge card. After submitting this discharge card only you can claim the hospitalization uh, bill. So we got to know for every hospitalization claim we need a discharge card. So everybody will get a doubt that where we can get this discharge card. This particular document will be certified by the doctor who is treating you at the hospital. And uh, the seal or a stamp of the hospital is mandatory on the discharge card. If there is no seal or stamp on the discharge card, then it will be invalid. So make sure that uh, you, have, you get the seal or stamp of that hospital on the discharge card. And uh, uh, make sure all the details are mentioned correctly on the discharge card and it will it should be certified by the doctor who is treating you at the hospital so this is how you can get the discharge card so this is all about discharge card check your tcs mail to know more about this discharge card hope i have explained everything which is there in that mail uh, if you feel this video is useful for you, then please like the video and subscribe to our channel for more information. Thank you.